Hi guys, it's Leanna from Leanna's Nest. Welcome back to my channel, or if you're new, I'm Leanna, this is Leanna's Nest, and I am bringing you all things home decor and DIY and baking for Christmas. I am in the middle of my Christmas 2021 series, and I am so excited. If you can't tell already, I am definitely a Christmas person. Christmas is my jam, okay? <laughs> so I have been so excited to be doing DIYs and be bringing you DIY videos. And last video was my first decorate with me video. And today I'm going to be bringing you guys along to decorate with me for my hot cocoa bar. Now, I'm more of a coffee person. I have my Mama Bear mug that I love. And um, I do enjoy a occasional cup of hot cocoa though. Um, I'm really doing this for my kids. Last year I did a hot cocoa bar and my kids loved it. So this year I'm gonna be doing it again, similar to what I did last year, but stepping it up a notch just to bring it more charm and have it more festive. My overall theme for my coffee bar is going to be like a candy cane. So most of my decor is red and white. Hopefully you guys get ideas from what I do to create your own hot cocoa bars. So get your own cup of coffee or hot cocoa and enjoy watching what I do with my hot cocoa bar and hopefully get ideas for your own hot cocoa bar. So this little area in between my kitchen and my dining room is where I have my coffee bar, which I'm going to be transforming into my hot cocoa bar. I'm going to be using two main signs for my hot cocoa bar. This one I got from Hobby Lobby and this Merry Christmas sign that I got last year and used in my coffee bar last year. So I laid everything out on my kitchen island that I wanted to use for um, my hot cocoa bar. A lot of things are things I used last year. Some things are new things that I got. And of course, um, the hot cocoa and perishable items that I got new this year. So I have got several different types of marshmallows. My kids uh, already tried out these ones. They like them and the cinnamon marshmallows and then the regular mini marshmallows I got. Um, I got some white chocolate caramel and dark chocolate syrup for um, flavoring. And I have never tried it, but I wanted to try it when I saw this gingerbread coffee. I also got the flavored hot chocolate, dark chocolate, milk chocolate, peppermint, and white chocolate from Marshalls. And I found these uh, chocolate spoons and peppermint spoons at the Dollar Tree, so I picked up a couple of those. Now, my husband and I favorite hot chocolate is this Ghirardelli hot chocolate. I went to like three different stores and I could not find a big package of them. So I had to get a couple individual packages. Hopefully I'll be able to find the different ones. Now I made this little crate for storing some of the hot cocoa bar supplies. I took six um, wooden unfinished wooden crates from Dollar Tree and I just turned over two of them to use as a stand and I glued everything together and then spray painted it red. I found these Stay Cozy napkins at Home Goods, and I'm using these straws I got from Dollar Tree and these uh, cups for guests uh, if they want to take to-go cups. I got these wooden uh, little spoons uh, with the peppermints on them from Hobby Lobby, 
and these little espresso cups I got from Amazon that came in a set of four of them. I'm going to be using two of them in the, co in the cocoa bar. I got these peppermint ornaments from Hobby Lobby. I'm not sure exactly how I'm going to use them in the cocoa bar, but I would like to incorporate them. So I have this set of jars and a tray that uh, I just spray painted recently. It was a galvanized metal color. I picked up these signs from Hobby Lobby, all 50% off, of course, the marshmallows, whipped cream, peppermint, and snuggle season. And this sign I had last year, I don't remember where I got it from, I feel like it was like home goods or something. Uh, chocolate's answer, who cares what the question is, goes along with the theme. This sign also came from Hobby Lobby, and uh, this one came in a tiered tray set from Walmart. Um, it came along with this little ho 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 uh, little cup that I'm going to be using too. These were both ornaments from Hobby Lobby um, and these ones I got it at home. These peppermint looking picks. Um, these little picks I got from Hobby Lobby and this, these candy canes also from Hobby Lobby. This one is so cute. Oh my goodness, it's an ornament from Hobby Lobby. I think that guy is so cute. <laughs> uh, this sleigh I got from the Target Dollar Spot. It's super cute. Now I have several Ray Dunn uh, mugs from last year that I'll be using, but I got these couple ones uh, this year uh, from Home Goods or TJ Maxx, uh, one of those two. Um, and this sign came from Hobby Lobby. My little coffee and milk canisters came from, um, they were, I had them last year. These cute little uh, cocoa or coffee mugs set I got from Home Goods last year. This cocoa canister came from Walmart last year. And um, it's a better look at the cocoa mugs. It's Cozy Fires, Hot Cocoa, and Sweater Weather, and Mistletoe. Now I have uh, several lights I got picked up from Dollar Tree. I don't know if I'm going to be using them all, but I thought this candy cane light was pretty cute to go with the theme. I have some felt that I'm going to be putting down on the shelf to make it look for snow. It came from the Dollar Tree. And I have a collection of tiered trays and risers that I got from the Target Dollar Spot that I've collected over the last couple years. And now I'm just going to start putting everything together on the hot cocoa bar.
so spoiler alert, I am going to have touches of Disney in my kitchen decor, and I'm going to keep these mugs when they're not in use on my hot cocoa bar. So I have this, um, it's actually a Lazy Susan. I got it from the Target Dollar Spot a while back, and I'm just going to have the mugs there with the cocoa canister, and I picked up these peppermint um, lights from the Dollar Tree, and I thought it would be the perfect touch um, to this tray. I made a faux whipped cream topper for my little espresso mug um, that I'm going to place here. I have a tutorial on how to make it on my candy themed Christmas decor video that I have linked below. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. I had so much fun putting this hot cocoa bar together. I hope you guys got lots of ideas for creating your own hot cocoa bar slash um, Christmas coffee bar. And as always, I would love it if you liked this video and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already so you get a uh, notified with my upcoming Christmas videos that I will be doing. Have a wonderful, safe, and happy holidays. Merry Christmas, and see you in the next video.